What's up guys? This video we're going to be talking about five potential fights to make in the UFC featherweight division. Uh, first fight is going to be Yair Rodriguez versus Josh Emmett for the number one contender spot. Yair Rodriguez coming off a win over Brian Ortega as well as before that an absolute war versus Max Holloway, an extremely close fight that showed he belonged with the upper echelon of the featherweight division. Uh, Josh Emmett coming off that win versus Calvin Cater also has wins over Dan Ige and Shane Burgos. Uh, and it's clear that these two deserve the fight for the number one contender spot. And uh, should the winner of that should be next to fight Volkanovski for the title. Another fight to make in that division is Max Holloway versus Arnold Allen. Max coming off that loss in his most recent title fight. And Arnold Allen has really made a push in the featherweight division. Uh, both guys are extremely tall and long for the division. I think that their body styles match up well for each against each other. It'll be interesting to see if Arnold Allen belongs against the top guys in the featherweight division. So I like that fight as well. Uh, another fight I like I would like to make would be Bryce Mitchell taking on Calvin Cater. Uh, Bryce Mitchell cer uh, currently sitting at number nine in the division. Cater sitting at number five. Uh, it'd be interesting to see if Mitchell can work his takedown and wrestling against a top five guy like Cater. Uh, if Cater is able to stuff the takedowns, how will Mitchell uh, be able to handle a guy with great boxing like Calvin Cater? I think that's a logical step to make as far as assessing where Bryce Mitchell is at in his career and if he's ready to make a shot uh, for a run at the title. And uh, next fight is going to be uh, Dan Ige versus Charles Jordan. I like this fight. Dan Ige is on a three-fight losing skid, so he's going to have to fight someone that's outside of the rankings to a hold on to that uh, you know, t number 12 ranking right now. Charles Jordan is a guy who's uh, done really well lately. He had that great fight with Shane Burgos that I thought that he won, but he didn't get the decision. And uh, before that, he has a win over Orlando Venata and Andre Ewell, and he's shown that he's an entertaining guy. He's an exciting guy, very good striker. Uh, I'd like to see him take on Dan Ige and see if he's ready to fight some ranked guys and guys in the top 10. And the last fight I would make is Nate Landwehr versus Leron Murphy. Uh, both these guys, extremely exciting, uh, like to stand and strike. Uh, Landwehr's got back-to-back -back wins over David Onama and Ludovic Klein. Leron Murphy on a three-fight win streak versus Marquan Amir Khani. Douglas Andrade and Ricardo Ramos. I think that fight would be very entertaining and potentially even be a co main event on a fight night. It seems like whenever Landwehr fights, he's got entertaining fights. Same goes for Leroy Murphy. He uh, hasn't had a boring fight in his UFC career. So, uh, you know, those are just some five fights that uh, I put together that I think would be uh, good matchups and fun fights for the fans. Uh, let me know in the comments uh, what matchups you guys want to see and what you think uh, the UFC is going to do as far as putting together these matchups in the featherweight division. Uh, I'll talk to you guys next video. Uh, see you guys.